Hey guys, Jack here. Got another Vivor product review for you. And you can see it way out there in the distance. It's a hose reel. And uh, my wife likes to do a lot of gardening and watering and stuff up here in the front of the house. And we don't really have water routed up here yet. So it was a good place to put that reel on the side of that tree over there and give her access to this. And I have that temp for now because I don't feel like trenching pipe in the middle of the summer but this fall i'll go ahead and trench a piece of pipe back to one of my uh pipe arms back there and, and that'll take care of that it'll be completely integrated at that point but i just wanted to show it to you it's a pretty cool little product i am one-handed today but i'm huh, not quite 100 feet and i have like a little over 100 foot of hose uh comes with this particular model that i'm reviewing for you today and you can see it just that's what it's supposed to. Isn't it? There's nothing special about it. It just brings water. Now, I will say it comes with two hose nozzle things. And like most things, Vivor, if they send you free accessories, you're like, gee, thanks, Vivor. Um, these are like your $7.99 discount bin nozzles out of, you know, like a Walmart bin or something. Uh, hose nozzles in general are crap. I would definitely recommend one for something like this, though, because... You know, you're pulling it out. You might want to have it on. I have to go back there to turn it on. So some sort of nozzle or valve or something to make your life a little easier. And I am one-handed today. So again, we'll see how putting this away works out. But I will tell you that, you know, I got a little kid in me too. And I know what everybody wants to do here is to uh, just let this thing go, but that is not the way to do this. I'm letting it slip through my hand and I'm gonna walk it in now. And you can see it kind of works like a bait casting reel. You just let a little tension on it. It winds really, really nice because it automatically kind of goes back and forth. It's got 180 degree rotation, pretty simple. It does come with anchors and bolts where you can put it into a concrete wall, which I think most people would do. This is going to work better for us. Again, I've got a pipe that comes from over there right up against the side of the house, and we can tee into it right there and bring it underwater and put a hose bib up here. Uh, as far as operation, pretty simple. Pull it out, and if you, if you pull up on it, it's going to want to go ahead and retract for you. If you pull down on it, it'll lock. It's that simple. Up it up to loosen down to lock. It's got a nice little stop. I'm sure you could pull on it and let it come flying in like the little kid in you wants to, but uh, I don't advise that with just about anything. I don't advise that with uh, tape measures, a uh, little anything. It kind of reminds me of like an out, uh, outboard boat motor or something like that, but uh, it works just perfectly. Again, the thing I would do. Just don't even plan on using these. Get yourself some good ones. I'll, I'll put a link in the video notes below to where I reviewed the two best hose nozzles I could find on the market today. And I'll put a side link, I guess, to there's one other I never wrote up. But there's three really good nozzles on the market. Most of them are crap. They just are. I'm sorry. It's not a Vavor thing. It's it's a hose nozzle thing. Anyway, guys, I will, uh, I will catch up with you later with another one. But for now, that's what we've got today. This is... Uh, Great product. Remember, if you use the discount code and link below, you can get another 5% off on an already great price, and you can support my show and the work that I do.